Well, welcome back to Trends and Friends. Now, UMC Children's Hospital has a new four-legged friend, and they named him Sable. And he's going to be working to help all of their patients basically de-stress during their time at the hospital. Our Brenda Lipinski got to meet Sable and talk to UMC kind of about what her work is right now. You know, we are very privileged to have Sable here. She is the first um, therapeutic dog that is in this entire region. Specifically, she was really brought in to help with our children. I think so many people have been overwhelmed that I think we're going to see that she's uh, in high demand everywhere. It's a hospitalized for a variety of reasons. It could be a new diagnosis or a trauma. And so Sable really helps me provide that next level of care and comfort and support that um, West Texas truly needs for our children's hospitals. Sable is two. Her third birthday is on May 10th. Instead of knowing commands, she knows cues. So she knows social cues. So I'm sitting here, I'm relaxed, I'm not going anywhere. So Sable's gonna do the same thing. I think from our standpoint, it's very common to see um, these children go through a very stressful time as they get a new diagnosis that may be difficult, or even that they're receiving new therapies that may be difficult to understand. But really Sable comes in and interacts with them, calms them down, and can even help them to understand how about that like differently. There was one patient who we saw in the burn unit who was really hesitant to walk and she, when she walked Sable she walked up and down the hallway. Or kids who are really hesitant to talk they will talk to Sable. Um, or kids who are about to have a procedure they want Sable there and they want to pet Sable. Her real goal is to help children be calm, how to interact with them, even kind of doing demonstration pieces. With Sable what I do is I have the patient give Sable her medicine, which is just a little bit of water in a syringe, and she takes it, and I say, well, okay, so Sable's taking her medicine. Is it okay if Sable helps you take your medicine? And the kids just whoop, take their medicine, and the parents are like, how did you do that? <laughs> how do I do that at home? So our pet therapy program, they're phenomenal, and the dogs who come up here are spectacular, but they're um, just social visits, more like meet and greets. Um, and they come for a couple of hours a day or a couple of hours during the week. And so Sable, she is here every day and is really involved in those patients who are not coping well. The literature is just so abundant in how dogs, they do provide that calming and relaxing effect. And also dogs, kids might have dogs at home too. And so seeing a dog, being able to interact with the dog, that's a normalizing activity. And that's part of my job too, is to help provide that normalization when kids are in an unfamiliar environment, such as the hospital. So when they are engaging in something normal, something relaxing, petting with Sable, petting Sable playing with her, that is something normal and that helps decrease their anxiety. This was really a community project. And so, you know, we appreciate how much the community invests in UMC Children's Hospital. Uh, because that is what this is really about, is that partnership to improve children's health care. And so I really could just say thank you to our community for investing in such an immediate, uh, in a, such an amazing way. Oh my gosh. Okay, Jacob, they say Sable's favorite thing to do is basically eat Cheerios <laughs> and just cuddle up with everyone at the hospital. I think everyone needs that little bit of therapy in a dog. Oh, you know, and I'm coming. sure Sable does not mind all the pets and <laughs> not scratches and hugs and all she gets, but just such an awesome thing. You can really see, really even is. from the video there, the kids just light up when they see her. So just awesome that they yeah. have uh, that kind of resource for the kiddos there. A very special thing for our hospitals locally here. But oh, yeah. thank you guys so much for tuning in today.